Hey guys, how's everyone doing today? I'm doing well, thank you for asking. Welcome to another episode of The Body Beatdown. I'm Michael, your incredible host. So, today is leg day. <coughs> now, I don't want to keep rehashing and going over everything 100,000 times, but just so you know, Friday when I was doing my back workout, I was doing some low cable rows, uh, 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 like this, and I bent over and my back went out. I kept doing my workouts, but anyway, my back went out extremely bad. Saturday, it was feeling a tad bit better. Sunday, a tad bit better. Today, Monday, I went to the chiropractor, got a little clickety-click. Uh, you know, it's not better, and it is still tender, uh, but we're going to pull through, and we're going to go ahead and do a leg workout, which is only most likely going to consist of using my hat press. Uh, I have done my walk and my spin on my bike, and uh, so and I did that uh, ever since I hurt my back uh, Friday. I don't stop, you know, unless there's exceptions, but typically I will continue to try to you know do things. So uh, and yes, I've had my back my back problem for 25 years, and uh, it's out. Technically, it's hurt and out every day. But then you have days like Friday that come along and like cripple you. So anyway, long story shortened into a short long story. So let's go ahead. I got a 45 on each side of the sled. And we're not going to just sit here and film the whole thing because that'll be boring. Nobody wants to watch that. I'm not some big name YouTuber, pro bodybuilder, pro powerlifter, etc. out there that people want to see. I'm just little old me. And uh, nobody wants to see 12 hours of me lifting. 12 hours? I don't know. I ain't going to do it 12 hours. So let's do, uh, let's start out and just get one little clip of this. We'll go ahead and adjust the camera whilst we're going right here and just, you know, enjoy ourselves a little bit. In hopes, in hopes that I can do this and not hurt my back. I should be okay and keep my back pressed into that pad and my massive legs don't rip through my pants. My handle. I couldn't find my handle. That's what she said. That's what she said. Ha ha ha. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Chris Rock wins. Now, the amount of weight that I have that I can use is only 400 and 90 pounds so I can only go up so high so uh, we're gonna stick another 45 on each side and go from there and uh, see how I feel hang around guys all right guys we've skipped ahead to the last or not the last but to my first set with all my weights 490 pounds no sense in boring you with the in-between stuff So, uh, trying to take caution with my back, make sure it stays against that pad. two more sets of these and I'll either figure something else to do uh, concerning legs or I'll be done for the day 
just kind of going by how I feel. So uh, anyway, yeah, I was looking on Facebook Marketplace and uh, there's a guy an hour away in Clarksville that has uh, some 45s for sale. Um, they're in bad shape like these here are, these black ones. They've been painted, they look like they've been outside. You know, why people do that with their gym equipment, I'll never know. But uh, I thought about going and getting them because I'd like to have some more 45s. I'd like to have more of everything, but if I can find good deals, I try to jump on them. If I got the money, I don't usually have much money. But uh, yeah, they were, you know, pretty much the same condition that these are. And I got these back in October for I think $75. I had to drive a little ways to get these. Plus I got that bar that I use, uh, that beat up Olympic bar, $75. But, uh, yeah, I don't know if I'm going to get those or not. I might hit him up and see if he still got them in a day or two. If he does, then I might go out there and get them. Uh, it's a good hour away to Clarksville and then an hour back, of course. So you got to make sure it, uh, it's worth the time and gas, especially the gas. <clears throat> but, uh, anyway... So I'm gonna do a couple more sets of these and then uh, like I said, I'll either call it a day or I'm gonna find something else to do or I might do some lighter sets with this. So we'll see what happens guys. So hang around and uh, don't go anywhere because you never know. decided to do and I don't think it's gonna do a whole lot for my body but it's gonna keep me moving a little bit uh, especially in the back area just a little bit uh, and burn a few more calories so uh, I've decided to do uh, I'm gonna comically uh, name it the stiff-legged Romanian dumbbell deadlift why because those two movements are very similar and uh, sometimes you can't even tell the difference. So I'm gonna try and uh, just use some 30 pound dumbbells and just get a slight bend over and a, and a nice uh, extension whenever I stand back up and uh, just kind of work out my back a little bit and, and stretch out my creamy hamstrings. So I'll take you on a little adventure with maybe a set or two of those just for fun, okay? So let's get these set up. All right, so as you can see, I kind of uh, I, I adjusted my lens to a lot a wider field of view, so it's gonna be a little distorted. Uh, so let's go ahead and grab these 30s with caution. Let's get it going. One. Two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten.
All right, guys, there you have it. You've seen my leg workout for today, and I'm lucky I'm able to do anything. So I feel really good about what I did. So uh, anyway, like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff to the body beatdown, me. And uh, I hope to inspire you in some way throughout your day. If I have, leave a comment. Also, leave a comment that will inspire me as well, because that's your job. It's our jobs to inspire other people every day including ourselves. All right, about to go eat my supper, about to be done and uh, call it a night. All right, get up, get out, get rad, do it to it. We'll see you guys later on the Body Beat Down. Get up, get out, get rad and do it to it.